Hi, I'm Rosalind Borland. I work for IOM in our regional office in San Jose, Costa Rica. Um, we cover Central America, North America, and the Caribbean. I started with IOM in Washington, D.C., in the U.S., and then I got my first international position in Costa Rica. In terms of my personal growth, I think a key moment was the first time I presented to 200 people with a microphone. I was at the General Assembly. Um, it was a high-level meeting on HIV-AIDS in 2011. I wrote all the speeches and got everything ready for the Director General at the time. And at the last minute, he was busy, and so I got up in front of the General Assembly in the UN and I spoke on behalf of IOM. So this is me, super nervous, on the big screens in the General Assembly room. Some of the difficult moments for me with IOM have been related to, to gender and gender expression. Um, I've worked a lot in Latin America where gender roles have tended to be a bit stricter, especially years ago. I'm a senior migrant protection and assistance specialist, so been around a long time. I've been with the same person over all those years. We've been together more than 20 years now, but for part of that time, she was not recognized by IOM. I had a partner from another country who couldn't get a visa, couldn't travel with me, wasn't paid for in terms of insurance. And then the country I'm from changed their policies, which meant that IOM made a change and decided to um, recognize her. Now she's part of my family, and if something happens, she's evacuated. If we move, we move together. That was a huge challenge, and that made a huge change in our lives. 